Jealous? Jealous, yeah, 100%. I'm not going to sit there and deny it. Jealous, yeah. yeah that's bad. I'm supposed to have feelings for Chloe, but I feel like I still got feelings for you. <laughs> Would you get back with him or not? I don't know. Mm. I don't know. It's just hard. I know, darling. <laughs> for girls, breakups are horrendous. It's like, imagine, like, having to convince yourself you don't want to be with someone that you still love. Of course. That's what it's like. And yeah. it's like being around him is still so hard. <gasps> and obviously we've got Oliver and... Yeah, it's like having your child. He still comes child. around and sees a dog and, like... I think Dan will always, always love you. I'm just freaking out and thinking, like, if I made a, a terrible mistake because I'm just older and, like, he, yeah, he loved me and you've just got to I just can't time. imagine meeting someone that, like, I loved as much as him. It's hard, isn't it? It is, yeah. If this relationship is meant to be, it will be. But until then, you've just got to give it time. And listen, you've got to be happy, darling, you do. You've got to find your love and your happiness one day and you will. Trust as you will. Everyone deserves to be happy. Mm -hmm. And that day will come. But you've just got to really find yourself again, find Amber Turner again. Give me a hug. Oh, love you. Coming out here and actually just being with you and her together, oh. like, it's made me realise I do, I do actually miss you a bit. <laughs> when when me, me, me and you were talking, it was easy. Oh. Like, you bring me out here. I'm supposed to have feelings for Chloe, but I feel like I've still got feelings for you. <laughs> Amen. Got a lot of explaining to do, Roman. So good luck with that. I blame you. you missed what we've got, man. Put it this way, she's not you. Right. <laughs> the things you did say about me were a little bit muggy, and I don't really respect that. I know you're laughing because you feel awkward, but you have been caught out. You did put me in an awkward situation. One, because I'm in a relationship, and two, because me and Chloe are friends also, now. Though, like, do you think like, that was a bit necessary? Like, oh. I feel like I've been so nice and respectful to you, and like, you know, the things I did just say to your face, I did truly believe until Danny called me and said the things that you'd said. I don't anymore. I don't yeah. think you've been respectful. I actually think you've been a bit... I've only ever been polite to you. I asked you was going to the party. Ella and you had a party the same night. I didn't go to either. No. That was nothing personal. No. And I made that clear. Yeah. You then said you didn't think I went to your party because of girls. And that, Chloe I said, and, I, I and Courtney. That. I you that's assumed. That's what I thought. That's just what yeah, I assumed. Yeah. Listen, whether you assumed it or not, you thought I didn't want to come to the party because I was going to start trouble with the girls. If you just texted me to Jill, I'm not going to make it tonight. Jill, I've got things going on. To me. I've always said your I don't need I've negative things around me. You. I need my friends Jill, at nights like Jill. this. No, but, no, but listen, you can look at, look at me. Don't look at do Dan. I? Dan ain't going to back you well, up. You're just saying well, that you didn't know. He oh, wasn't aware. Oh, I don't judge you on anything. All right, all right. He wasn't aware. Saf, you've been my friend since he was four or five years old, yeah? Do you think I want to throw a friendship away like that?